What's up guys, so Redmi K20 Pro or I would say Xiaomi Mi 90 is about to launch in global markets and in this video we are going to be taking a look at OnePlus 7 versus the Redmi K20 Pro and we also have the K20 non-pro model which comes with the Snapdragon 730 and some of the few downgrade specifications and we also have the OnePlus 7 Pro which is also a very similar phone as of the K20 Pro but the display kills every competition which makes its price higher than these two phones. So now here it is the OnePlus 7 versus the redmi k20 pro and in this video we are not just comparing its specifications but we will also talk about the real actual facts and things which might help you a lot to choose one of them so starting off with display so you will get full screen super amoled display with the k20 pro whereas the oneplus 7 has an optic amoled panel with water drop notch so if you want a full screen experience without any distractions with super amoled panel then you should go with the k20 pro and if you are okay with water drop notch then it's fine to go for oneplus 7 now the second thing is the pop-up selfie camera on the k20 pro now this thing you should know you want to be able to get instant access to the front camera and it is a motorized mechanism which may stop working in future which is not possible by the way because we have seen so many phones with this mechanism but also it is not impossible also xiaomi says this thing will work fine till 300,000 times this means if you take selfies 50 times a day that makes it 1500 times a month and 18,000 times a year and so on so 300,000 is definitely a huge amount this thing will be durable for sure but still it's a motorized still can catch some dust so if you want a fully safe side then you have to go with oneplus 7 only compromise you'll get a full screen display but if you believe this thing will work with you then you should go for the k20 pro next thing is the ui so the k20 pro has a miui interface whereas the oneplus 7 has an oxygen os so for the oneplus 7 here's an absolute win but if i have an option to pay 100 or 200 dollar less then i'll definitely go for the k20 pro but obviously everyone has their own perspective oneplus 7 not having a headphone jack and also oneplus won't provide you a usb-c to 3.5 millimeter dongle out of the box whereas the k20 pro has a good old 3.5 millimeter headphone jack next one here we have cameras so the k20 pro has triple camera setup whereas the oneplus 7 has only two cameras both models have same sensors sony imx 586 48 megapixels but both have different algorithms and there's also an ultra wide angle and telephoto lens on the k20 pro whereas the oneplus 7 only has a depth sensor for that bokeh effect and also here's a minor difference in terms of battery we have a 4000 millivolt battery inside the k20 pro whereas the oneplus 7 has a 3700 millivolt battery and the good thing about the k20 pro is that you can charge the k20 pro with up to 27 watts of fast charging speed whereas the oneplus 7 only has 20 watt dash charger but if if you want to utilize the full 27 watt of fast charging in the k20 pro then you have to pay a little bit more to buy this fast charger because xiaomi will not provide you this out of the box so yeah that's all here in this video thanks for watching and let me know which one you like to pick and yeah see you soon